Howdy everyone, Mr. Kanzi here with another problem of the week and this week we're going to need a periodic table and you're going to need to know the periodic table, the quantum numbers and electron configurations. Let's see what it's all about and this week's problem give the four quantum numbers for the electrons in the first shell and by first shell we mean first energy level and that's 1s2 all right let's analyze the whole problem here that means we have one subshell the s subshell we have one orbital and we have two electrons in that orbital to the magic blackboard our configuration as we said is 1s2 and our orbital notation is going to be uh, one uh, sub energy level s which is zero the numerical value of s is zero and then we're going to have two electrons in there now this is going to be pretty easy uh, to figure out from here because now we can go ahead and look at our quantum numbers we have two electrons so let's say e sub one and e sub two and each of those have four quantum numbers n is the uh, energy level L is the sub energy level and the type of orbital. M sub L is going to tell us the position in that orbital and M sub S is going to be the uh, spin number. If you look over here, we have one and that's our energy level uh, number. So N equals one for both of them. And then L, that's going to be which subshell. And of course, S is zero. And then it only has one sub level. So that's also going to be zero. Look right over there, it was zero. And then we have M sub S. Well, first one in is usually one half plus, And the second one in is negative one half plus. And that's kind of just a convention. I really don't think it matters as long as one is plus one half and one is negative one half. Dealing with counterclockwise and clockwise. All right. That's all there is to it. There's the four quantum numbers for the first energy level. So let's recap. We determine the configuration, we determine the energy level, we determine the sub level, and then we wrote the four quantum numbers. The way to get good at writing quantum numbers is just to do them over and over again. It's just practice. All right. As usual, if you have any questions, send an email to Mr. Kazi at mrkazi.com and check out mrkaziesworld.com. You can see PowerPoint videos and much, much more. And subscribe to my YouTube. Go there and sign up. And also take the time to go ahead and like this video. Happy Islands, everyone.